Title V and scandal unseated them. Now it's up to voters to choose the next person to represent them in Congress. Yeah, we are one week away from the special election to fill the seat that was occupied by Trent Franks. No Holony Graph is tracking that race. And no hey, are the candidates stepping up their campaigning? Absolutely, Dan. Signs are popping up seemingly every day. Just on this corner, we've got every candidate represented on every corner, it seems. Maybe you've even heard more ads popping up online and on TV. You know, this is actually a huge field of candidates. 13 Republicans, two Democrats, all looking to take over disgraced Congressman Frank's seat. But a recent poll actually narrowed the field down to four candidates to watch. And it's also switched up their positioning. The firm OH Predictive Insights shows Debbie Lesko and Steve Montenegro are neck and neck for first place. Phil Lovis is a distant third. And after a controversy about his name, Bob Stump has dropped from first to fourth place. Also, a lot of money has been poured into this race. Senator Ted Cruz and his super PAC are backing Montenegro. Also, former County Sheriff Joe Arpaio. State Treasurer Jeff DeWitt is putting his support between Lovis. And there's also a lot of experience in this field to be matched. Lesko and Stump also like the other two have previously served in the state legislature. So decision day within a week now and we'll know the results next week Tuesday. I'm Nohelani Graf live in Peoria, ABC 15 Arizona.